And would you just look at Braun Strowman, one of the most impressive powerhouses we've ever seen in WWE. Strowman hasn't met a man or structure he couldn't topple over. Yeah, if there's one thing that absolutely defines Strowman, it is impressive feats of power and strength. And coming out of the other corner is Sami Zayn. You better recognize that Sami brings the fight and will make you believe. If Sami's heart is beating, he's got a chance. Whether you believe in Sami's cause or not, you can't deny his unrelenting determination. He's dedicated his life to this business. Braun Strowman seems to always come to the ring with pure malice in his eyes. Does that incredible fury give him an edge in this matchup? It absolutely can. That bloodlust can drive Braun to do superhuman things inside the ring. But he also can't lose sight of the task at hand. The goal here is to win, not break the other guy into a million pieces. Braun needs to stay focused and not let his rage blind him. That was one of those power bombs that would shorten someone's career. It was treading all over their opponent. Was ready for that. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. That aggression of Strowman being met in kind. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. He climbs back into the ring just in time. That was getting close. Sammy making the climb. We're gonna finish it off. Swirl to Goes into the pin. Power right out at one. An emphatic kick out, and there's still a lot of game left here. Yeah. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Great reversal. Grabs the leg. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Taking a moment to get pumped. Strowman can smell victory. Running power slam. Boom. Absolute destruction from Strowman. Heading up, he's thinking big. From the top. From the top with a splash. Things went from bad to worse. Check out this power. Military press way up there. Military press slam. Damn. Oh, man. The monster among men bringing it now. That's impressive how even with his rage boiling over, Braun is still obviously focused on getting this match won. Kick out. Sami Zayn playing to the crowd now. Oh. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Oh my gosh, what impact. What now? I got right to the gut. He has him right where he wants him. Up high. Look out below. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Soaring out of the ring, 
looking to do as much damage as possible. Now Strowman feeling the pressure. Now you don't often have your way with Braun like this. Ooh, that might have just broken something. What a barrage of stops. Right in the middle, relentless. Enough already. He's heading back to the ring. Zayn heads up high. He's oh. up high. Whoa, what a landing. The one-two punch of high risk, high reward. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Oh, my God. Oh, this is the mark. This match is brutality starting to show on him. This is where endurance becomes so... A bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. Bear hug. Well placed elbow. We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is. Nasty boot by Zane. Serious jeopardy for Strowman. The cover. There is nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. One on one, here we go. Oh, and a low blow. Using the cage as a weapon. The jarring impact. The always vibrant and energetic New Day ready to square off here. While they have fun, we've seen New Day have what it takes to win in big time matches. Yeah, Michael, that doesn't mean you should let your guard down when facing the New Day, or you're likely to become vulnerable to their explosive and surprising offense. Actually, Byron, I'm surprised because that's true. There's no telling what new tricks the New Day has packed in their bag for this match. But when you face Imperium, you face the fight of your life. You'd be hard-pressed to find a more polished, disciplined, and lethal group of superstars. When Imperium gets in the ring, they are all business. Yeah, calling them stern would be an understatement. For Imperium, this industry is a serious matter that other superstars have turned into a laughingstock. And in Imperium's eyes, that's a wrong they themselves must correct. Agility. Nice arm drag. Looking to catch him off guard. Only getting one out of that pin. Premature to try to end things now. And what's this manager looking for under the ring? He has no business down there. Straight to the knee. An effective attack to the leg can hurt everything from balance to mobility. It can drastically limit you inside the ring. Snap suplex. The better part of Valor. Oh, Blackjack! Gosh, landing face first. Fist drop! Oh, driving the elbow. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And Giovanni didn't find a counter to that. Yeah, it looks like the New Day was able to catch them by surprise. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. <laughs> Quick sidestep by Vinci. And Giovanni's resolve might be wavering here. Vinci's not showing any capacity to fight back. And back. He's in there. Finally. And after that shot to the knee, what could be next? Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Continuing to work on the arm with a drop in the knee for more punishment. Sky high! Way up there. 
This could be it. Cover. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. The springboard attack fails to land. Lands face first. Oh, wicked. He thinks he has it. Is a break before the count of two. Easy kick out there, but they'll get harder soon. Using the ropes. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Stopping their opponent. And the forearm smash. Clean tag for his partner. Boom, what a drop kick. On the mark. Still no end in sight here. Giovanni Vinci fears no man. Vicious right forearm. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Crash landing, powerbomb. What goes up must come down, and it sure as hell did right there. Great reaction from Kofi. Xavier Woods, weirdo, face buster. Nice. Into the pin attempt. Two, almost two and a half. The end was in sight. Comes in off the tag. Put into the corner now. Double axe handle smash. Snap power slam. He's going for the pin. This could be it. And there's the save. Let's keep fighting. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Tagging his partner in now. Whatever Kaiser intended. Ooh. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Tag made. Oh, I think something bad is about to happen to their opponent. There they go. Will Xavier put it away here? Cover. He stops the count for his partner. Right to the spine. Xavier Woods in with the tag. Turn it around to hit a DDT with authority. Tagged in. Suplex. Oh, look at this. Suplex. Oh, my. What a display of dominance. And the cover for the win. This is it. Oh, did he get him? Two and a half. Down to the wire. Who's going to give in first? He's got him up on his shoulders. Only fireman's carry. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Almost ended it there. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. And not a hair out of place as Ludwig salutes the crowd. Yes, tag. No way. Set time. Throwing off. Caution to the wind and leaping to the outside. I don't
don't know how these men keep going. They gotta be close to running on empty by now. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? He may be in a bad way here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Referee's count only getting higher. Come on, gotta get back in the ring. Oh. Oh. Big time win in this tag team match. A count out is always a tough way to lose. Not the win they wanted, but it's a win nonetheless. Johnny Wrestling is all about taking the fight to whoever is in front of him. No one has desire like a gamble. Gargano is known for doing the incredible, and he'll continue to throw down until his Rebel Hearts got nothing left. Any competitor who's going to lock up with Gargano needs to be ready to get hit with anything. Here comes Johnny. But if you're looking for shoulders down for the count, gets his shoulder up right before two. Way too soon for him to be thinking about a pin. Oh, a kick right to the gut. Another one. Another one. Combo. Ah, oh, saw it coming. Corey, from what we've seen of Johnny Gargano in the ring, do you think he has any bad habits that an opponent could potentially use to their advantage? Well, the first thing that comes to mind is Gargano's fondness for showing off his skills. He can maybe be a little too pretty in his attacks sometimes. If you're patient, Gargano might just hand you a prime opening as he's going for a tricky move. That's when you capitalize with an attack of your own. No, that'll break his arm. Vicious. And Gargano is falling behind. Patience paying off for him here. Johnny left himself open with his flashiness, and that prime opportunity got fully taken advantage of. Shoulder up. Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. Way to steer clear. <laughs> and he's taking this to the outside now. Nice Russian leg sweep, and the octopus stretch is applied. Well, is it? He's in deep, deep trouble here. Well, maybe not. Able to slip out of things in a couple of them. Hands right to the mouth. Delivered into the barricade. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Gargano is finding himself at a disadvantage. Johnny needs to decipher a solution to this situation. Fast. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Their opponent is down and in bad shape, but that's not stopping them. Man. You're an Augie. And into the count. And there's the kick out. He's not even close to being done yet. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. This is truly disheartening to watch. These are such talented superstars, unfortunately, resorting to every possible tactic they can think of. To do Stone Cold it's over! That could ground Gargano for good. And Johnny Gargano just couldn't pull out a victory here in this one. This is not where Gargano wanted to be when this thing was over. This loss will weigh on him for a long time. A heartbreaking defeat. You have to wonder what's going through Johnny Gargano's mind right now.
The Fireflies are out. And Bray Wyatt is here. We have all watched as Bray Wyatt has slowly spiraled out of control. No, I think this is what was always in there, just bubbling below the surface. Yeah, Byron, but now it is completely taken over. Take a look at an athlete who exists on a level unto himself. Seth Rollins is a fighter, a survivor, and he is on a quest for greatness. And the WWE Universe is singing his praises. And his opponents, first from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 270. A storied career, Rollins has held every singles and tag team title of note in WWE. The first ever NXT champion, the first man to hold the newly minted World Heavyweight Championship. complete competitors this industry has ever seen and is a cornerstone in WWE. You want to prove yourself? Test the visionary. Jey Uso is here and he is a new man. Something of a new position on his own. Some trepidation, but also some freedom. Well, as much as he gained from the bloodline and his brother, becoming the main event is something Jay needs to do on his own. And Jay is more than equipped to do it. stars in WWE, but his following grows every single night. And Jay looks ready to deliver on his unbelievable hype.
Three of WWE's best in what should be a hectic triple threat match. This competition gets underway with Bray Wyatt, Seth Rollins, and Jey Uso. Triple threat matches are a beast of their own. No disqualification, no count out, and twice the threat being pinned or submitted. Is this necessary? Rip it at the eyes. That was showing great awareness of positioning, placing yourself between the ref and your opponent. <laughs> Snap power slam. Oh my god. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Oh, right in there. Ripcord Lariat! If there's one match type that's all about knowing when to pick your spots, it's got to be the triple threat match. Being a smart competitor means biding your time, letting the other two superstars in the match tire themselves out and wear each other down. Then you just have to pick the bones like the in-ring genius you are. Honestly, sounds more like an in-ring scavenger, Corey. This will win the... Looking to free the arm and does just that. And when he's got that chair, you know he wants to send a serious message. Samoa drop! And he slides him back to the mat. And Bray just taunting his opponent now. Rollins escaping danger. Planning on what to do next. Oh, a <laughs> Boom, what impact. Now he can end it here. He gets an emphatic kick out. An almost instantaneous kick out there. A lot of work left to do. This one should have been over, but he breaks the hold. Put her in a position now. Targeting the throat there. Good timing with that reversal. Just lighting up the chest. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. Hoisted up, double underhook. Weaves out, counter with a vicious clothesline. There it is, the people's punch. Oh, jeez, nasty kick to the face. There it is, snap suplex. Hey, you can't do that. The tried and true method to taking anyone down. Rollins with a head of steam. Big air. Stuck. Shoulders are down. Makes a cover. And he's still in the game. And chills have to be running down the spine of Wyatt's opposition. Takedown. Looking for the cross face. It's cinched in. This could be over. Eyes it. We're going to free the arm and does just that. Looking for a belly to back suplex. Back suplex into the neck breaker. Lands in the drop zone. He thinks he has it. And he fights it off. What a match. Bray Wyatt on the move. What a counter by Rollins. Side of the ring now. What's the plan here? We've seen the sledgehammer many times before, and it has never been a first sight. Oh, basically hammering their opponent into the floor. Oh, look at this. What a headbutt.
jumped out into the defensive. This should come as no surprise. In a havoc-filled triple threat, you're going to take some big hits. These men have been giving each other such a beating. And you can see the toll of that beating taking effect with every movement. take to keep this guy down. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for a submission. Seth Rollins, he breaks up the hold. of victory coming out on top against two very capable, very prepared competitors. To win a triple threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner showed all three in victory. These two men, John Cena and CM Punk, couldn't be more different. John Cena's a dynasty. He's an institution to this industry, whereas Punk is the ultimate anti-establishment rebel. But one thing they do have in common is a desire to be the best to be the lone man standing at the top of this industry, at the top of the world. That shared ambition has led to them butting heads plenty of times. And so we find ourselves here again. Two legendary superstars who have never been able to see eye to eye go all out to settle things once and for all. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, God, that hurt. Just punched him right in the mouth. Enough already. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Yeah, that was that hustle of Cena he's always talking about. What's he open to find down there? He's thinking a steel chair is just what he needs to wreak some havoc here. Shot, straight brutality coming right at you. Evading offense. And some say the only limit in an ODQ is your own imagination. Right, so Saxton wouldn't stand a chance. For everyone else, though, the sky is the limit. Anything you wish you could do to get a win, you could probably arrange it here. So my advice is to hold nothing back. Check out this power. Deadlift gut wrench applied. 
landed a suplex. The amount of force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. He's struggling a bit here. Yeah, and there is no end to what more scene is capable of. All the way up. The big time power bomb. Now that's what you call impact. Telegraph that one and delivers a face first. All set up. Now the Koji clutch locked in. We know it's How's he gonna get out of this predicament? Elbows his way out. Elbow drop. Piercing. Muscles up their opponent. Emerald Frozen. Cena plans in motion. What is Cena doing on the top rope? John Cena, you can't see me. See and there's the cover. Here is your winner, the greatest of all time, John Cena! What a big win for John Cena in this epic clash against CM Punk. Punk loves to get under Cena's skin. I'd wager Rhea Ripley comes into this match with nothing but bad intentions. She's a superstar who seems to enjoy tormenting her opponents as much as possible. There's nothing wrong with taking pleasure in your own handiwork. Inflicting agony just happens to be something Rhea has a natural talent for. Who are we to question what brings her joy? That's one way to look at it, but I doubt her opponents see it the same way. They see Ripley as nothing but a nightmare to deal with. And she's facing the ninth wonder of the world, China, one of the most dominant superstars on the entire roster. Yeah, China never fails to rise to a challenge, and nothing can stand in her way when she has her eyes set on a goal. Oh, watch it! Gosh, landing face first. It's a bit of a stalemate when it comes to the strength game between Rhea and China. We know that China typically relies on that advantage. Corey, how can she tip the scales in her favor? China has to think on her feet here, Colt. From way up, Bobby, double axe handle. Some mental chess here from China. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. And targeting the leg there. Ah, oh, foot just stomping down. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. Sure, of course, line. Ah, oh, she counters right back on China. Ripcord, Lariat. Three. Mounting a downed opponent, look at them go. Over and over and over again. And a slap for the exclamation point. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Oh, this is not going to end well at all. Oh, my Inverted. God. Inverted Alabama slam. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. China in the cover. No, a kick out. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Look at this. Dead looking there. An unyielding showing of authority, no two ways about it. Back up, Did you see that? Talk about dismantling your opponent. Drops a knee. She can end it here. Just after two. At this point in the match, 
that could have gone either way. And a brazen display of confidence from China right here. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Is it enough here? She kicks out at one. And those kickouts are only going to get harder. Places are right in the corner. Athleticism by the ninth wonder of the world. The patented dominance of China on full display. Guys, truly, I need to know, when will enough be enough? When is this going to end? They truly want to rip each other apart. I think you just answered your own question. This doesn't end until they rip each other apart. There's no happy ending to this rivalry. There is no saving grace. Ooh! Slugging it out, toe to toe now. Nothing pretty here, just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Oh, a strong impact! Ah, oh, she misses the mark. Rhea Ripley dead set on China now, looking to put her... Kick to a gut by Ripley, final by... China won't come back from that. Everyone in the building thought that was going to be the end of it, myself included. Ripley needs to become a little bit more brutal to close this one out. Oh, and a stomp right to the back. Both of these women have been scratching and clawing to be the first one up the proverbial mountaintop. It's almost unfair that only one of these women will get the victory, but at least they'll both get the glory. China out of harm's way. And that was an efficient form of offense for that move. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. And China is getting worked on right now. Rhea's power seems to be hard for China to comprehend here. Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it, I'm out of here. Excellent opportunity for her to shift the momentum. This could be a good chance for China to get some distance and rethink things. And guys, she's dangerously close to a count-out loss. And now gets tossed into the ring. That could dislocate your shoulder. She's going for it. Celebration. A heartbreaking defeat for her opponent, but she is yeah, soaking left in it the all moment. out there. Look, this was an incredible matchup between these two. And she, what, what the? Why? Well, because she can, I guess. I guess winning the match wasn't enough. She wants to make sure her opponent oh, never competes again. This is just sad.